No other religion did this. 2,000 years ago, there is no male or female. There is no Jew or Greek. There is no bond or free. But they're all equally Christ. Think about what that's saying. Think about what that's saying. Oh, there's no men and women. See, it was like (laughs) non-binary. Clearly, he was all for this. There is no such thing as gender. No, it's not what it meant. You always honor what you've been given. If you're a woman, you honor your feminine aspects because it's something unique to you. I don't get it. I'll never have a baby in spite of what some people tell you. (laughs) I can't. It's a unique thing to you. It's something sacred. It's something that you should revel in because I'll never have that experience. Men are the warriors. Men are the ones that stand in front of the women, fight against, uh, for them and to defend them. We're the ones that created constitutions and we're the ones that created uh, countries and we're the ones that invented these uh, uh, abilities for us to communicate and do things. Men have a role that's unique and special. To come in together to become one is beautiful. Honor your masculinity. Honor your femininity. But you don't identify as that. You identify as a child of God. Now you're one. There's no Jew and Gentile. What does that mean? That we're not supposed to remember the history of this nation? There were slaves here. Should we forget that? Why, that's what they want to teach, right? They don't want CRT because they don't want the real history of America to be taught. Nonsense. You know why I know there's slaves in this nation? They taught me in school. You know why I know there was Jim Crow in this nation? They taught me in school. You know why I know that there was a civil rights movement? They taught me in school. You teach every stinking thing that happened to this nation because it didn't do everything right. Nobody does. We're filled with sinners. But how dare you tell me that this country is systemically racist when we've spent hundreds of years trying to find a way to have every ethnicity and type of human being on earth come together as one. It's never been accomplished in human history. It never will be. But we tried and we continue to try because the Bible said there's no Jew or Greek. You are Jewish. You have a history or heritage. Embrace it. Be grateful for it. If you are of African descent in this nation, you were brought here without your consent. Terrible. And in 200 years, you became the president of the United States, multi-billionaires, attorney generals. You proved the American dream even in the midst of your turmoil that anybody can succeed if they refuse to be called a victim. It's lies. 